Dear viewers, I heartily welcome you to our today's commentary about the ever-increasing Monday demonstrations for peace in Europe. Since the Second World War, our continent has been widely spared from armed conflicts. Wars took place in countries far away and they, for the most part, did not affect us fundamentally. Yet through the events in the Ukraine, the people sense intuitively that this could develop into an uncontrollable, warfaring wildfire. Valued viewers, how do you personally cope with this existential threat? Many resigned people are of a strong conviction that an ordinary citizen cannot do anything about this. Today, we will show you an encouraging example of how a single man can defy resignation. Lars Merhot says, We must change something in this world. It must not stay as it is. But you have to stand up for this, meet with people, talk to one another, and show your displeasure. The way things are right now on this planet, well, it shouldn't go on like this. He decided to take action against the threat of war and the one-sided manipulative news coverage by the mainstream media. That's why he initiated the first Monday demonstration for peace in Berlin. We already reported about the small beginnings of this picket for peace on the 21st of April. What has become of this little plant? The initiative of Lars Mehrholz triggered a wave for peace which thousands of citizens have already joined. After 100 participants in the beginning, the numbers grew from 400 to 3,000 and up to 5,000 participants on Easter Monday in Berlin. But not enough. Meanwhile, it's not only in Berlin where Monday demonstrations are taking place, originating from the initiative of a single man, but in 48 cities across Germany, Austria and Switzerland. In Stuttgart, Germany, an initiative started as well. On the 10th of May, we were on location with a camera team. We are here on the Palace Square in Stuttgart. Hundreds of people gathered here for a big demonstration initiated by the Peace Movement Stuttgart. The main trigger for this demonstration is a threatening military escalation in the Ukraine with possible unpredictable effects for the entire European continent. The initiators expressed their concern about the responsible politicians in a press release. The German federal government does not seem to strive to contribute to a de-escalation in the Ukraine crisis. Isn't it encouraging to see what developed, not only in Berlin and Stuttgart, out of the commitment of a single man? A motivating sign standing far above all resignation, which has spread among many citizens. It's worth it to stand up and become active. Lars Merholz proved this. At the following link, shown after the program, you can get informed about where to find such a demonstration in your area. Actively join this common movement. Make your friends and acquaintances aware about these demonstrations for peace also. People all over Europe, and especially in the Ukraine, will be grateful for this. We say goodbye for now, closing with a quote from Eric Kessner. Have a good evening. Nothing good happens unless one does it.